Hi, my name is Michael Lehman, and this is Trailers from Hell. Today we're going to talk about Seconds, a film that John Frankenheimer made in 1966 that is absolutely fantastic. It's flawed all over the place, but incredible to look at, and a lot of fun, and holds up amazingly well over the years. Let's take a look. I'd never heard of Seconds until I was um, working for Francis Coppola in the early 80s in a low-level job, and Coppola came into the office one day and looked around at everybody and said, have any of you guys ever seen the movie Seconds? None of us had. We hadn't even heard of it. And it took me years to be able to actually find a copy and see it because uh, at the time, movies weren't available on tape. They weren't available in any form. Uh, you have to wait to catch them late night TV or wait till they showed up in a revival house. What I think Francis liked about it and what struck me about it when I finally saw it is the incredible stylized wide angle black and white photography done by James Wong Howe. Rock Hudson as a second, freed from all responsibilities, now ready to taste new pleasures. It's, it's a very stylized story. It's a great idea. It's a very contemporary story. And really, in a way, it's the ultimate midlife crisis movie. This is a movie about a guy who, uh, towards the end of his middle age, is roped into, partially voluntarily, partially by force, uh, subjecting himself to a complete makeover, a, uh, a complete makeover of the kind that they now have in reality TV. And he's sent out from New York with Rock Hudson's face to live in an artist colony in Malibu. Uh, it, it has great performances from John Randolph, who plays the, the, uh, the man in his uh, original form, and Rock Hudson, whom he becomes. And uh, as I keep saying, it has the most unbelievable photography and is absolutely gorgeous and intense and interesting and bizarre. Reborn. Oh, Laura! 